What's up y'all? Keith Dykes here with WKD Construction and welcome to my channel. On today's video, I've got a special guest coming by, Tad Fuller of Fuller HVAC. They have been installing all of my units, all my HVAC stuff for the past 15 years. So I asked Tad to come by and I was just going to ask him a few questions and uh, we could share with y'all, but Tad is very, very knowledgeable about anything to do with HVAC. He has got his own channel at Taddy Digest on, on YouTube. He does lessons. Uh, man, he, he, <laughs> he has got it going on, on, on the YouTube. Uh, like I said, very knowledgeable, knows everything. So I just wanted to ask him a few questions and, uh, we can kind of go over with y'all. If, if you have a foam insulated house, what the importance of uh fresh air you need to introduce why why do we need to introduce fresh air into our hvac system if you're just now joining us here at the wkd construction channel man i thank you very much uh we have got a lot of stuff going on we have started on my house i still haven't i still haven't finished filming or not filming but editing all the videos for the Melton Farm Project. So we still got a lot of stuff and it's really getting into some good stuff at the Melton Farm Project. But we have started on mine. That's what some of these boxes are and all the PEX plumbing. Uh, we have been working on the foundation and we are gonna be installing some radiant heat. So man, we've got a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff that's gonna be coming up and uh, I would like you to uh, watch it. Uh, oh man, that beeping. What? Who in the? Who's that guy? Who that guy is? Come on, bro, guys. What's up, Keith? <laughs> What's up, dude? You doing all right? Yep. Taddy hey, from Fuller Heating and Coolings here. So we're gonna go in and, and talk about some stuff. Yes, sir. There he is. What's happening, brother? What's up, guy? What are you doing? I'm just checking out this boot here that we installed for the fresh air. Little fresh two, air. Little two by ten. Fresh air. He said it. We've got a uh, gas burning unit, and uh, this is Taddy. <laughs> I Taddy mess it digest. up every time. Taddy Digest yes, on YouTube. Check him out. But anyway, he uh, he's at the uh, Fuller Heating and Cooling, which uh, does all of there. My subcontract does all my HVAC units. Has been for. Yeah. Ah, see, my daughter is. Decade, man. My daughter is uh, 15, so I think she, we start. I think the first house she was she was born, so that's been 15 years. Yeah. Uh, so man, they do the best work around. Hard pipe everything. They hand make everything. No flex pipe. Yeah. Everything is done right by the book. We do have a fresh air boot. That is not. We're not going to be heating and cooling out here on the porch. Uh, but why? Why is it important to have fresh air? Um, when you have a foam house, you have a very tight envelope and you don't have a lot of infiltration, which is air from inside to outside, outside to inside. So when you have a very tight envelope like that, you can get a bad indoor air quality. And you wanna have good air quality, and especially if you're in your home most of the time. So having a way to pull in fresh air uh, to constantly have good air quality inside your home is just a good idea. And there's different ways you can add fresh air to your home you can have an ERV or an HRV which is an energy recovery ventilator or a heat recovery ventilator uh, but we make it very simple we, we use the KISS method keep it simple silly <laughs> <laughs> there you go but hey I was I was looking at the uh, unit and uh, there's some sort of custom fancy uh, return uh, a filter on there and I was like what in the heck is that yeah. So let's let's go up in the attic and we'll check that out. All right, so we got easy access up into the attic. Miss Susan, Miss Susan did not want the pull down staircase, which they suck. So yes, uh, we got a full set of stairs, Finally. which is uh, great for the HVAC guys. Yes, but sir. But this this right here, Tad, is kind of what I was seeing. I seen some brass brass accents. Uh, okay, I got you. I got you. So yeah, so normally you don't want two filters because you don't want uh, double uh, filtration like this because you have too much pressure drop. And when you have too much pressure drop, you increase static pressure. 
so you lower the airflow and you don't want that because you need good airflow uh, to be able to have good temperature splits and such but you can see that boot right there that's the that's, line that's that, what runs outside that's correct yeah and then it comes over here and it goes into the return side of this uh, gas uh, furnace so whenever the unit runs we are pulling in about five uh, percent fresh air and this is a easy the easiest way to add fresh air in because otherwise you'd have a big box right here and you'd have like four vents going to the outside so and easy this, this and this way. is way less money right 100 percent, yeah, yeah way less money and you can see this right here this is what you call bobbinized okay because <laughs> movie b done this bob and mr bob barrett yep and he, he will bobbinize <laughs> and bob's been there for decades and de now. yeah 20 something yeah, i think i saw on facebook they posted Over 20 years you need him to build anything he can build anything <laughs> out of sheet metal yeah so he's excellent you, you gonna fire this baby up we're gonna fire it up not today probably maybe this afternoon we got to get a grill count we got to get how many grills we need come back and put all the grills in and then we'll do the commission process when uh we get back probably okay well, let's go down here and take a peek got a fuller heating and cooling offers a service that i don't think any other uh hvac company offers it is gas piping they run all of their own black iron piping track pipe whatever you need so uh mr bob and uh well tad they come and get a uh like i said a grill count and uh bob came by measured up what he needs mm -hmm. uh to hook up our gas meter yep we got the one inch line right there and we got a gauge on it because we always do a pressure test gas company wants a pressure test and we fax that in they come out they verify that the amount of pressure was on there for a certain amount of time different um, counties have different times and pressures they require and uh, we'll come out we'll put an L on it uh, and then we'll hook it up to the meter All right. Ooh. get the heat turned on because it's gonna be cold next week well, when Mr. Tad's talking about grills, he's just talking about all of our ceiling registers. Yeah. Ceiling registers, then we've got the return in Who the hall. Black? What? Who painted our red boot black, man? Their boots Who painted be, it black? It's supposed to be galvanized. <laughs> <laughs> I do. I paint them. It's a little something, a little quirky thing I, I do. I don't know. That way you look up, you're not seeing something shiny. You put the grill on and... Uh... <laughs> That way, I don't know. I, I just I've been doing it for a long time, so that's cool. But here is the grill, the uh, return grill. This is custom. This is this is custom. Don't be don't be knocking it. <laughs> but they're gonna, they're going to get a cover on there, and uh, that way we can get a uh, legit filter on there. You're always doing something unique, man. That's awesome. <laughs> All right, y'all. Mr. Taddy, he's gonna he's gonna he's gonna bail out and go get our grills, all that good stuff. Then he's gonna come back and uh, get the units fired up. Mm -hmm. uh, and, I'll keep uh, you cool if you let me. There you go, Taddy Digest. Hit him up. He's he's got some good stuff, man. Appreciate it, sir. Yes, sir. See you. Got it, coach. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Bye, Tad. <laughs> He's a nut. He's a good guy though, man. Like I said, at Fuller Heating and Cooling, they've been, I've been working with them for 15 plus years. We're right at 15 years. And just Rusty, which is Tad's dad. He's been running the company, started the company. Just super great people. Love all of them. Just just great, great people. So uh, they do what they're gonna, they say what they're gonna do. They're, they're, they hand make everything and uh, don't cut any corners so you get you gotta stay with the sub that that that's like that you know what i'm saying all right y'all that's it uh that was that was a good uh good little chat with tad <laughs> like i said tad tad he's a he's a nut but he is a good good guy and man he is he is knowledgeable about like i said anything anything to do with hvac so he he is up to come down and talk with me make a video whatever whatever needs to be done. So I will, we'll definitely have him over for, for some more stuff, uh, and, uh, put him on, put him on here. I've been doing live streams. I'm going to start doing, 
I think I'm going to start doing uh, job updates, project updates every weekend on my house. Like I said, we got a lot of, a lot of cool stuff coming up. Uh, so we're insulating the slab. We're going to put radiant heat in there. So a lot of cool stuff. So I am going to do live, like I said, try to do live streams every, every week. If you're not a member, you will not, it, I'm not going to do it every week for you. For the members, I will do every week. Uh, if you're not a member, maybe, maybe once a month. So, so definitely check into my memberships. And oh yeah, FYI. <laughs> On my memberships, I will be giving away good items, good stuff, badass items. This is my first giveaway. Aquar freezes faucet. Yep, check it out. It's gonna be it's it's badass. So once again, I'm Keith Dykes. This was my video on talking HVAC with Tad. Thanks for watching and <laughs> got it, coach. Y'all have a great day.